We're just doing a, a revetment wall inspection here in uh, Rod Yon. Uh, we always concerned when we see concrete behind the revetment wall. What's happening, you don't notice if there's uh, subsidence or whatever. But this is a construction joint. Uh, the wall is uh, had a joint made of construction to allow expansion and contraction. And it had a rubber sealant put in at the time of construction. But over time that deteriorates. And we find especially that it deteriorates down here below the tie bottom. And if you can look there, you can see that there's actually no sealant at all in that joint anymore. It's all rotted out, all the grabs have taken it away. So you can see that I can push right through the wall there. So those gaps in the wall allow sand to uh, wash out because the concrete's on top of the sea. So we check to see what's actually in the wall. I can reach under the slab with this. Just to give you an idea, I can go to hold it here. I'm going in underneath the slab on an angle to find out where the sand is. Okay, so I'm in that far. So that's the size of the void underneath the, that slab. So that slab's not sitting on anything. There's just a hollow underneath there. And that hollow is you know, almost a metre across that way before we're hitting any form of sand and the sand that is in here is quite soft because it's uh, slowly undermining every time it rains, every time the tide comes in and out it's taking more and more sand out. So the treatment is we have to seal this uh, crack and it needs to be done properly. You can't just squirt cigarettes in there, it just falls back out again. Uh, it's got to be uh, debrided, uh, debrided and then uh, fresh water wash and primer and we're going to use a marine rated uh, seal in there and we've got to get the tide just right so we can do it all the way down to the footing. So uh, yeah, if you've got concrete behind the wall, I really recommend that you check what's happening because you can't, there's no indication from on top that this is a fairly major problem. Easy to fix. Okay.